I start melting and bring it in and start melting and sending it out. So tonight in Clears Tai Chi, we worked on exercises for really building, exercising, and increasing sung uh, relaxation and release, and actually building that quality more and more, and having it to be something that you can use and that eventually you can even direct. And so with this, when you do your form, the first thing is you do a really good Wu Chi where your head is suspended pulled, if you will, from the jaw and the back of the neck up, and then everything else hangs off of that and is pouring. And when I say pouring, think about having a pitcher that's filled with water and you could just and pour it all out. Not that. It would be more like I want a steady stream to come out and I want it to come out for a long time. So I turn the pitcher just enough that my stream starts and I never want it to stop. And it's continually pouring, continually pouring, continually pouring, continually pouring. Continuing, 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 long, 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 like a long time. And so when you're doing this, you've got the structure, and then you start immediately by relaxing and releasing, but you don't just relax and release and hit a stopping point. You relax and release, and it continues. So you feel this weight going down, and you let it go down into the ground, and it continues and continues and continues, and even when I move up my leg for whatever your first move is, I still have everything else pouring downwards, and when it comes over here, and even around that leg, it's pouring downwards, and it keeps pouring, and it keeps pouring, and it keeps pouring, and when my arms come up, it feels like they're pouring as if, if there was water being poured on me, a lot of times in the beginning, it'll feel like honey or thick, like a thickness that's kind of moving, and I keep it, moving downwards, moving, moving downwards, moving downwards, and through my torso as well, it's this continual pouring, and then this way as well, continually pouring, continually pouring, continually pouring, where you really feel this, and you want it to be good enough that if someone were to feel you, like if he's standing here, that when I start doing that, he feels the initial drop through inside of me as well, and then it continues, even when I'm bringing up the other leg, he still feels this pouring sensation that's continuous, and it's still pouring the whole time. And even when I'm coming up, he feels the pouring inside, and you want it to stay. And it keeps pouring, and it keeps pouring, and if I get stuck somewhere, you'll wanna wiggle, move enough, relax enough, maybe even tense it for a second and then let it go. You want to tense it and hold it long enough that it gets fatigued a little bit. So that way it keeps pouring and pouring and pouring like that. And then if you're pushing with someone, I want them to feel this pouring right away. So go to shove me out. And it just kept pouring even when he did it. And if I'm, like, if I've got one arm over top of him somewhere that I'm not doing this, that's me trying to, this way, it's that melt release, continuing my whole body having the pouring action and sensation to it, like that. And then also that if somebody's really having trouble with it and I'm helping them, I might actually, put your hands on me once, go to pick them up and then I want you to pour down through between my hands like that, just as a helping thing. Go ahead and pouring down, downward, downward, downward. You can put hands on. Yep, that way he's just heavier, heavier, heavier. And really the whole time, the whole time, the whole time, the whole time. And it's just an exercise to do that once. And down is the first direction we want to do this in. A, because we want that melting sung ing sung ying, pouring down into the ground around the structure. I also want to be able to take anything that's coming into me, if he pushes into me like this, come like that once, and I want it to be able to ground it down and out like that. To, you're good, that was good. You're good? Yeah, I'm good. Good yeah. What'd it do? Yeah, it's, it torque my wrist a little bit, it's good. It's good. Okay, and then, um, and so there's that. And then I also want to be able to aim it, let's say that we're on there, so that I can take that same sensation, that same internal movement, and I want to be able to aim it. Now, if you can't do it really well and fast and with volume and continuously down to the ground, don't try to aim it somewhere else yet. Gravity is helping you take it down. It's the easiest there is.
to make it go sideways and out or up, that's a lot, that's your mind having to direct that a lot more. And it's against gravity. So gravity with gravity, that's the easiest. And so from here, go ahead and push me. And you can feel the movement across. Come slower with all that. Slow but strong. And so this is down for the minute on me. And you can feel the, the out come again. Because <laughs> yeah. you can feel the movement yeah. that direction, which is a lot different than that. And notice, come on again. Oh, different. Go ahead. Oh, different than that. It's not that. Come again. Because I'm letting it pour across. Okay. So have fun working with that. Um, obviously, there's more on um, clearsmartialarts.com with our intermediate Tai Chi program. And um, let me know how it goes on the training. Thank you. On a pushing thing, like try to try to catch me there a little bit first. Like come to yeah, like that in different ways and down, think down and think up and maybe pulling me inwards or whatever, right? All the above. And so make sure your legs are good. And so what happens, I can be here and I'm physically, but I start melting and bring it in and start melting it and sending it out, right? Melting it and like this was just pushing. Yeah, you could feel that, you could feel that waterfall <laughs> effect this kind of a thing, I'll let you see it on the other side. And it starts becoming that, but it won't be that if you can't really move it pretty quickly and well and with volume. Anyone you want to feel that, jump out here real quick. And you feel the return of the same thing as it felt with the down. A little, I'll do it slightly slower. Yeah. Okay. Same feeling, except now it's directed. Okay. Yep. Okay.